Hey guys, today we're going to talk about managing water flow in your aquariums. Now, uh, when you buy a standalone filter, for example, you have an adjustable output. So that's kind of an easy, uh, you know, method of adjusting the water flow you require for your particular aquarium installation. When it comes to a lot of these desktops, like our spec tanks, like the flex tanks that we sell, the outputs are not adjustable. So there is an actually really cool tip for you to use to reduce the flow, uh, or in fact, just divert the uh, current or employ some aquarium decor to, to deal with it. Now, in terms of reducing the flow, well, A1387, this is the actual input strainer or the filter strainer for the filter that's supplied with the Fluval Edge. You can see that the foam has a nice uh, circular cutout in it to slide over the, the strainer of the filter in that case. And on the other end, of course, it's all blocked up. There's a small closed cell foam. So when you use it uh, in the manner that we have over here, and let's just have a quick look at that. Um, we've tie wrapped it in this case over the output nozzle and you can see the betta, there's a male betta, there's absolutely the fish is not experiencing any water current at all. So when you really want to diffuse the current to the maximum and create a slow movement for the tank, that's really the optimal solution. It's a very inexpensive tip to reduce water flow in your aquarium. Even the spec three, you can see the same deal. The male bed in there is very relaxed, not being affected at all by the water current. So it's no more complicated than that to reduce the flow. Another option you have, of course, is by employing a piece of decorative driftwood like this Mopani wood, simply placing it in front of the nozzle or uh, directing the nozzle so it hits this will diffuse the water current all through your tank won't really be an issue anymore if you have fish that might be affected and then of course something like a large uh, plant like this in this case it's a it's a uh, decorative synthetic plant that you could place in front of the uh, nozzle direct the nozzle output into now over here we have a couple of flex tanks they too of course have adjustable nozzles uh, here's the 15 you can see that the surface movement is uh, quite strong and we actually have the nine gallon over here which um, we will put here let me just put the, ca the canopy down we will put the um, foam over the nozzle now you can see this nozzle is moving the surface of water around quite well because of the way we have an angle so it's very visible we're going to take the foam block simply slide it over and you can see that the output has really been diffused to the point where there's no visible movement anymore at the surface. So there you have it. The ABCs of uh, water movement management in your aquarium depends on the type of fish you have. In fact, many fish originate in rivers. Current is not an issue. Some decorative structure in tanks more than adequate to provide them with some respite from, from the areas that have stronger movement. But if you really want to cut the flow down, a1387 Fluval uh, uh, Edge intake sponge. Real easy way to do it. Thanks for watching.